Hey guys, welcome to Mark the Point. Well, if you've been following my channel at all, you already see something different, right? Yes, that's right. I got a brand new layout, a brand new table. I've got my custom ATS, Mark the Small, Mark the Tall, and Mark them all. We got some hops sitting right here of every number. I got the, my brand new logo. This is my new Mark the Point logo for the table. Guys, I couldn't be more excited. Also, with the up here at the end, the Mark the Point at the top. I hope that you like the table as much as I do. I've been waiting a long time to get it ready. For the videos now on for the video here right guys today i'm going to roll out my absolute favorite system i played i would say in the last three months guys i love the way i'm about to roll this out make sure you stay tuned because this i'm not just saying this this is exciting what i'm going to be playing here is the absolute outside drawdown okay the outside drawdown is a very aggressive at the beginning okay i just want to make sure you understand there's going to be a lot of risk here okay that's $300 sitting here on the outside. Risk, I understand. But let check this out. Let me show you how this is going to work. I have $75 on the 4 and 10 and $75 on the 5 and 9. Let's start with the outside first. As soon as we get a point, the point's going to be on the 9. Each of these is going to pay $150, guys. A $75 bet pays $150. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and set this right here. That's going to say that's going to go to my rack. I'm going to draw down by one quarter each, okay? Draw down by one quarter each. So let me show you what that looks like. That's 100, that's $250. I currently have $250 into my rack. My initial investment was 300. I have 250 back into my rack and I still have a $200 bet sitting out here. You have any option you want to right now. You could actually do this if you wanted to. You could actually take these numbers right here and go strictly on the inside. You could keep it outside here and drop down to uh, ten dollars and go one hundred and sixty across, and still have plenty of profit going back to your rack. But in this case, what I'm going to do, I'm going to keep it here. I'm going to keep it at the fifty dollar level at two hundred dollars on the outside. Let's say we get one more hit. Again, I'm going to go with the, the best case scenario with the extreme outsides of four and a ten. That's going to pay us a hundred dollars. Fifty dollars pays a hundred. That's another black chip. So I have one, two. $300. That's my initial investment. I have $100, $250 profit after two hits. Again, this is extreme outside. At this point in time, again, you can always go back to all the way to one, uh, 160 across. Again, dropping an extra $10 for the six and eight like that. Or you could be a little more aggressive if you want to be a little more aggressive. You could take this money here and continue to press up this inside. Go ahead and drop down 20 bucks just for the dealer. You still have $200, but you have a little bit of risk here because you're not all the way out in the hand. I would suggest getting in a little bit of profit before you make this move. Now, let's show you what the five and nine is going to look like. I'm going to reset all this back up. Just a second. Okay, guys, I've set this all back up. Again, I'm back at $300 on the outside. I'm going to show you how this works with the five and nine. This is the worst case scenario, okay? But even so, either one of these is $75. That's going to pay us $105. So $105. Again, I'm going to draw this down by $100, okay? To so draw down four, a quarter off of each level, I have $100, $205 back into my rack. My initial investment was $300. So I'm only in this hand for $95, bucks and I got $200 working for me. Let's just say it hits again, the 5 or the 9. The 5 or the 9 is going to pay us $70, $70. Bucks. Again, all this is profit now. You're totally out in the hand because what you're going to do is you're going to pull all this back down. And again, you can go to 160 across. Let's go ahead and pull out the original 300. 100, that's 200, that's 300. That's our original bankroll. Now you have all this to work with. You can go 160 across, 160 plus $15. That is your profit for the shooter just hitting the five and nine two times or either one two times. All right, guys, I want to show you how much profit I'm confident at the end of this that we're going to have profit at the end. Just stay in wait. All right, guys, I'm ready to get rolling here. I have a $2,000 bankroll kind of split up here uh, between blacks, greens, and reds. Let's get a first point established, and here we go, guys. All right, that's going to be a six. The point is going to be on the six. That's a 426. Let's mark up the six. Let's mark up our new little markers here, right? Mark the six up. I'm going to drop down. $300 to the dealer and say, take me $300 on the outside. Again, when we talk about the outside, we're talking about the four, 
in the five and the nine in the 10. That's our four outside numbers, outside versus inside. Let's go, Shooter. Here we go. All right, that's going to be a five, three, eight. Okay, that's going to be the easy eight. That doesn't help us out because we are not on the eight. We're not on the six and not on the eight. And there's a 10 down there on the end. That is a perfect big bend, guys. That's going to pay us $150. That 10 pays us $150. That's a $75 bet. I'm going to regress it down one size, one unit, each of these. Now that's $250 going back to our rack. All this is coming back to our rack. That black chip, 100%, is coming back to our rack. And here we go. Let's go ahead and mark the 10 down there on the end. And that's going to be a back-to-back. -back. How about that? 10 right there. That is going to be the hard 10, guys. I'll take that all day. That's a $50 bet. That's going to pay us a black chip. That's $100. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and play the inside here. I'm going to drop that $100 there. This is going to come back to our rack, so I regressed everything down. I'm just going to drop $10 down to the dealer and go $160 across. I will start going a little bit more aggressive once we're in profit. We are not in profit yet, so we are not going to do that. We're going to drop it down to 160 I got profit in my rack. Let's keep rolling this thing out. And there's a nine. That's going to be the five, four, nine. That's going to be the hard nine, guys. All right, guys, we're going to pay us $35. What I do is I take $10 and put it on my nine. I put that quarter right back into the rack. A nice little press. And I love to collect that green chip. And there's an eight, guys. That's going to be the easy eight. That's going to be a six, two, eight. All right. So what we'll do is, again, that pays us $35. That's a $30 bet. Let's go ahead and drop down $2. This is my move here. I drop down $2 to the dealer. They take that $10 plus the $2. That's a $12 bet. And they take it all the way up to 42. Say, dealer, take me to 42. And that's exactly what they'll do. All right. Here we go. That is the eight. And the nine's already been marked as well. And that's a four to six. That's going to be an easy six, guys. Again, $30 bet pays me $35. I'm going to drop down $2 just like I did. And that's going to go up to a $42 bet. Quarter goes back to the rack. The puck is off. Let's move it over here. And I'm ready to keep it rolling, guys. Here we go. All right, there's going to be back on the six. That's going to be the easy six. Let's mark the six, and we're ready to roll. There's a four, three, one, four. All right, guys, here we go. So what's going to happen is that will pay us $50. Now, I am not paying VIGs on my table. I did not mention that earlier. I don't play the VIGs. I mean, it would cost you a dollar for that. But I'm just going to go ahead and put that back into the rack. I'm going to collect, and I'm going to press. I'm going to collect, and I'm going to press. So the next time, I'll press them both up. Here we go. And there's a back-to-back, -back, three, one, four. We'll take that right there, right? That is a four. So that is going to pay us, again, another $50. So what we'll do is we'll take $50, put it here, and we can, I like to do this. Now, personally, I like to press the six and eight first before I press anything else because they're more likely to hit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press this right here. I'm going to drop down $10 to the dealer, say press my six and eight just like that. I'm going to make sure I put them correctly. Okay, then I put a red chips on top of here, and there we go, guys. I love that move. I love it. I love it. And I have a $72 bet sitting there ready for me. I'll take it all day long. Here we go. And there's a 516. Absolutely love it, guys. That is the 516. That's going to pay me $84. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to call it 75 85 for one. And that's going to be a collect. I'm going to go ahead and put that money back into the rack just like that, guys. I love it. I love it. That is our point. Let's go ahead and turn the point off. And here we go. Let's go ahead and forget. We did own a mark that four earlier. We did hit it twice. All right, that's going to be back on the six. That's our third time the point's going to be on the six. Let's mark the six, and here we go. Boom. Hard six, right back, buckshot. That's going to be another $85, guys. Another $85. It's really $84 or $85 for one. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and press this up a little bit, make it a little bit easier bet to work with. Let's go ahead and make it a $120. One, two, three, four, a hundred and $20 bet, guys, okay? And this year is going to come back to our rack. I love this press. I love getting more juice out of it, guys. I want to get juice out of these inside numbers after I took advantage of the outside. That's the goal. The point is off, and here we go. All right, that's going to be a one, two, three. No help to me. That's a throw craps three. Let's mark the three. There's a five, three, eight. Okay, that's going to be our new point. That's going to be on the eight. Oh, we're knocking over chips. Knocking over chips. All right, here we go. Let's go, shooter. And there's a five. We have a shooter, guys. 
We have a shooter that's going to pay us $35. I take that $10, I put it on the five. I put the quarter back into the rack just like that. Again, we got out of this hand in the first two hits. Everything we're doing right now is profit. At any point in time, you can bring any of this money out here back into your rack. I have over $200 sitting here if I wanted to put that money back into the rack. Here we go. And there's a hard eight, a hard eight, guys. That is the square pair. Love it, love it, love it. Here we go. That's seven. Again, that's going to pay us 85. So we'll call it 85 or 84, 85 or 84 for one. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to press it up to a $120 bet. So let's make it look just like that. That's 120. These are coming back to the rack. And here we go, guys. We are all in on the six and eight right now. Again, you could spread this out as much as you want to, but as much as these are hitting, you might as well play it out. The puck is off, and here we go. And there's a nine. Okay, that's going to be our new point. New point's going to be in the nine. That's the center field nine. They call it the center field nine, guys, because if you look here, here's your field bet. It's right in the center of the field. That's why they call it the center field nine, just for those who didn't know. And there's a six. Boom. Check us out. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. That six is that's a $120 bet. That's going to pay us $140. Let's do, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's call it $150 for $10. $150 for $10. Okay, just like that. And now I'm going to put this all back into my rack, put that black chip in my rack, put that back in my rack. But what I would do is, because it is already up there, I'm going to regress this all the way back down to a $30 bet. You ask, why? Why would you do that? Well, I've gotten a hit out of it. You might as well. You might as well secure this profit. Put that money back into the rack. Any money off the table is money and profit in your rack at this point in time. All right, here we go. Let's keep it going. And there's a five. All right, that's going to be the four one. That's an easy five. All right, that's going to pay us 50 for one. So I'm going to drop the dealer a dollar. They'll give you $50 here. So what I'm going to do is because I just pulled that money back, I can go ahead and press this up. Let's go ahead and press the four and press the 10. And what I am going to do is I'm going to go ahead and exchange these out for black chips. Guys, that's $500 in greens. I'm going to do one, two, three, four, five. I'm going to put these $500 back into the rack. So this money is secured. I'm going to pull this up front because I need the green chips. And now I have money to work with on the bank. And let's keep it rolling, guys. And here we go. And there's another five, guys. What a dang shooter we got here. That's going to be another 50 for one. What I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and press this up. Uh, again, get a little more juice out of these things. Let's go ahead and press up the five and nine. I'm just going to make them straight $50 bets. I'll pull the red chips back. So I got $50 bets on the five and nine, just like that. And there's a one, two, three, craps three, no help to me. And there's another five. That's the four one this time, guys. That's going to pay us 70 bucks, $70. What we can do is go and collect this. Collect this money here because uh, we've already pressed twice in a row. Might as well put the money back into the rack. All right, here we go. Big bets. Big bets. There's boxcars 12. All right, looking for the two and looking for the 11. Let's keep it going. There's a back-to-back -back boxcars. Are you kidding me right now? Check us out, guys. And there's a 527. Okay, so this roll has come to an end. But my gosh, was it an epic roll, right? So here we are. We're going to pull all this bets back. Everything here, that's okay. We're going to take that. Why? Because, A, we're making the bank throw money all over the table. That's why. Because uh, we are stacking up these reds. Let's make sure I stack these up correctly. Ah, here we go. All this is coming back. All right, we're going to unmark everything here because we did not hit the ATS. But uh, that's okay. We are just playing with it. Just playing with the markers for fun anyways. Let's turn that off. Let's turn our butts off, and here we go. All right, that's going to be a hard 10 down there on the end. That is going to be our point. Let's mark a point down here, and I'm going to drop down $300. In case you forgot the original system, let me show you. It's going to be $300 on everything, guys. It's going to be 75 75 and 75 just like that on every number. Here we go. And that's going to be a one, two, three, craps three, no help to me. Let's mark the 10 and let's mark the three, just like that. And that's a five. Okay, that's all right. That's a five. That's going to be a four one. That's going to pay us $105. Okay, 105. We're going to pull these all the way down one level. So this is going to be $200 and five, $205 coming back to our rack. 
So this is coming back. All oh, this is coming back to the rack. Let's mark the five, and here we go. Let's go, shooter. And there's a five to seven. We did not get out of this one, okay? We got a hit, but we did not get all the way out. We left about $95 out there on the table, so we did not get out of this hand. Let's go ahead and turn the puck off. Let's unmark these guys that did hit, and let's keep it rolling again. Here we go. And there's going to be an eight. Okay, so that's going to be the easy eight. Let's mark the eight. And uh, here we go, guys. Let's get another $300. Let's drop it down to the dealer and say, take me uh, $300 on the outside, just like that. All right, here we go. We're ready to roll. And there's a nine. That's going to be the, the 639, the center field nine. All right, that's going to pay us 105 Okay, 105 We kind of know the drill, right? Going to pull all this back, pull back $100, which is $25 off each one. Here we go. And that's going to be an eight. That's going to be an easy eight. We are not on the eight yet, guys. Not on the eight. And there's a three, another three. Let's go ahead and mark up the three. There's a six. Again, not on the six. Waiting to get there. We're still on the outside. And there's a 10. Okay, that's great. That gets us out of the hand, guys. That gets us out of the hand because that's going to pay us another $100. We're going to regress this thing all the way back down. Again, I'm going to go back to 160 across. Um, maybe I'm a, this time I'm going to do full presses, right? So instead of doing little half presses, I'm going to do full presses to try to see if I can build up my bankroll to get more profit back into my, to my rack. Already, Here we go. Let's try it out. That's a 10. Let's mark it up. And here we go. And there's a Yo 11, a Midmo Chiro. No help to me. But that's all right. Here we go. There's a six. All right. Hard six. Again, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and press this up all the way to 60. I'm going to give the dealer, the dealer's going to give you back $5. Actually, pays you pays you 35 excuse me. Pays you 35 It's going to go all the way up to 60 Here we go. Just like that. And there's another five. All right, here we go. That's going to be the no field five. That's going to pay us 35 bucks. I'm going to go up to 50 Again, I'm going to be a little bit more aggressive. We're in profit. I'm going to be a little more aggressive personally. Mark the five. And there's a nine. Let's, do you want to do it again? Can we do it again? Do we trust the shooter to go up to not? I'll tell you what, let's do it. Let's do it. So we are, we are aggressive right here. Let's see how much we can get out of this hand. Let's do it. There's a six. Okay, it's worked out so far, right? Worked out so far. That's a $60 bet. That's going to pay us 70 bucks. It pays us 70 Uh, What are we going to do? Let's go and press up to eight a little bit. Let's do that. So I'm going to press up to eight. I'm going to make the 860, and I'm going to collect that $40 sitting right there, okay? Press that, make the 860, press that up, and uh, let's keep it rolling. There's a five. That's going to be the easy five, the three, two, five. Again, that's going to pay us 70 bucks, guys. $70. What am I going to do? I'm going to collect this one. I pressed the last three. I've got to put money back into my rack. I'm going to collect that one. And there's a nine. Oh, yeah. I love it. Okay. I'm going to start going all the way out now. Here we go. So that's going to pay us another 70, right? Pays us another 70. Might as well start pressing again. Put that into the rack right there. Press them up. And let's keep it rolling. I'm only looking for one more hit. And there's a six. That's going to do me good, okay? That's going to pay me 70 bucks. 70 bucks, I'm going to put that into the rack. And what I'm going to do is, because I've hit so many presses here, I'm actually going to pull this thing back down a little bit. Uh, not all the way, but I'm going to pull it down a little bit. I'm putting an extra $50 back in my rack. I'm going to keep my six and eight up because why? Well, they've been doing pretty good for me, so let's keep it up. But uh, everything else can come back to a little bit lower level. And there's a big red, a great time to regress, right? Right when big red hits, that was a five, two, seven. All right, here we go. What I'm going to do is, I'm, because we had two long shooters and it didn't show everything, I am going to go ahead and count it up though, right? I'm going to count it up and see how we did. Let's pull all these back. Let's pull this out the way. So this is here. Let's move all this out the way. I want to count this up and see. We started with $2,000, okay? So let's start here. Started with $2,000. And what I have here, right here, let's see what I have. I, that should be $2,000. I'm going to count it up just in case, just in case. That's one, two, three. Four, five. That's five. That's going to be a thousand. That's fifteen hundred. That's two thousand. It is. That's two thousand dollars. This was our initial bankroll. Okay, exactly what we started with from the very beginning. Okay, so let's find now. Let's check our profit. That's one, two, three. That's four. That's five hundred. Pull this here. This is a hundred dollars. That's going to be 600. So that'll be, pull it over there. That'll be 600. 
grab some of these reds here, put them together to make them hundreds. That's going to be 700 right there. Okay, that's 700, 725, 750, that's 760, 765, 770. Seven seven hundred and seventy six dollars profit, guys, and about a thirty minute video. I'll take that all day long, any day. Seven hundred fifty bucks. Hey, this has become my favorite system that I've rolled out in probably the last three months. I love this system, guys. I've got to get on board when I'm playing in Vegas. When I'm playing on my next cruise, I maybe try to play for comps, but I'm going to play aggressive like this right here because I love that money coming back to my rack immediately. Guys, I put out videos like this every single week. If you enjoy this content, please make sure you're subscribing to the channel. Make sure you hit that notification button. So every time I put out a video, you are notified, guys. Until next time, mark the point, stay awesome.